that, Jeff. As we get closer to the Super Bowl, we get less time with the players that are currently in the game and more time with guys like this. Mike Golick joining me tonight. We're at Ditka and Jaws Cigars evening at Monday Night Brewing's Garage. Mike, thanks for uh, joining me this evening. And I, I just want to ask you about this season's Super Bowl. What is the matchup that you are most looking for? Well, I think without question, and it's not even that because I'm a former D lineman, it's the New England O-line against the Rams D-line. That New England O-line, they haven't given up the sack the entire postseason, which is just amazing. Their interior three, two guards in center are ranked amongst the top 15 in pass blocking. And then there's Aaron Donald on the other side, the leader in sacks, and gets double the most and beats it. But that D-line and what kind of pressure they can get on Brady, and I mean pressure right up front, not on the edges, but right up front in Brady's face to make him have to move his feet. How about Jared Goff? He's playing behind a pretty good offensive line as well. If he can sneak up on this Patriots defense, how is he going to do it? He's going to do it with the way he's been successful all year, the last two years as a matter of fact. They've had the most play action passes and he's been the most the highest completion percentage of play action pass quarterback. So you have the running of Gurley and C.J. Henderson now, but I think Gurley's going to be a big part. So that threat's there. Their play action pass is deadly. That freezes that those linebackers. It freezes the, the quick rush of the defensive line and gives him that extra beat in the pocket to find his receiver. So that's what he's done well, and that offense has done well for two years. That's what, that's what they're going to bring to this game. All right, Mike, looking forward to it, man. Really appreciate it. Cheryl, toss it back to you.